Okay, we have uh, Nuri Burakadi, um, member of the board of uh, the European Smalltalk Users Group, ISUC, and assistant professor of uh, the Col de Mines de Douai. Um, Nuri, as a uh, old member of ISOC and co-organizer of this uh, conference we're having here, um, what could you tell us about ISOC? ISOC is uh, a non-profit organization that was found on uh, uh, 1991 and uh, the, or the, the board at that time decided that it was a good idea to introduce uh, small talk to spread the word and so they decided in 93 to organize a summer school a, summer, a small talk summer school and since then every year there were, there were a summer school that changed into a con conference and every year so since uh, for 17 years so far we are having a yearly conference where we gather small talkers from around Europe uh, and uh, introduce uh, uh, small uh, introduce them to small talk uh, also allow uh, small talkers that are located in different places in in the world not only in, uh, from Europe uh, come and meet and uh, interact and actually from this the the idea of having an event that gathers small talkers uh, the, the 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 board decided that it is interesting to have other actions to promote small talk so we have multiple actions uh, we have uh, uh, we promote uh, education so uh, teaching small talk we encourage people to 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 teach small talk in their u universities we also encourage students to do internships in small talk we also uh, encourage uh, open source uh, free software project uh, around small talk uh, almost any initiative that helps small talk and helps the community can be uh, sponsored by isag and supported by isag and we uh, we have this light dynamic flexible languages so we uh, the, the isag Organization maps uh, on this uh, map maps on this idea and uh, organized uh, with with flexibility. So we have light process for deciding which action to 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 promote and in order to to have a small step to for people that want to propose something to the community. Any any initiative to to the community, we are considering considering it. And uh, we we want also to promote small talk not only for the outside of the community but also inside. We want people n learn about what what are doing uh, small talkers around the world. We have people in Argentina. In we discovered here in Spain nine, nine uh, very interesting stuff. We have people in Ukraine. Currently, we are discovering what's happening in Asia. There is a, a lot of activity around small talk in Japan. We discovered there are small talkers in China. There are we have um, uh, people in uh, in Vietnam, and I mean uh, in in all countries, the the ISAC is a European small talk user group. Uh, but the European part of it is that the event is organized in Europe. The yearly event is organized only in Europe. But actually, actually, the actions, the the promotion, the small talk promotions actions, uh, targets all the, the world. And uh, one of the the the, the, the important actions, uh, from my point of view, of ISAG, uh, is that we we want. New student learn small talk, but not only in uni their universities. We want them to to s to meet experienced small talkers in in conferences like the the ISAC's, uh, yearly event, like the, the 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 small talks Argentinian conference, and we are. Uh, uh, we, we have this uh, students volunteers program and similar programs that that help students uh, go uh, and co encourage them to go to place where they can meet uh, experts in uh, in small talk 
even we even subsidize uh, students that go do intern internship in small talk. There are so many actions we are trying to 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 push, and we have uh, 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 very active communities and people are uh, are demanding and people that are offering their help. So we and. Really, there is a lot of energy in this community, and the, the, the goal of ISAC is to fuel this community. Thank you very much, uh, Nuri. Um, I also would like to ask you, um, as I said before, you, you are a system professor at the university. So Smalltalk has been mainly used in industry since the beginning, uh, but it's, it's also... Uh, very interesting and in, in academic context. There are probably lots of uh, research fields where small talk uh, may make a difference. Um, I would like you to, to, to tell me um, how small talk helps in your research. Does it really make a difference? Uh, actually, uh, I'm using small talk both in education and in in research, and uh, uh, to uh, answer your question about about the, the research part, uh, w w when I was wor doing my, my my PhD, I was doing uh, studying languages and uh, extending languages, and uh, I was doing it in small talk at that time. Small talk was uh, the uh, an important uh, language in, in industry, and uh, this is why we we, we were looking at it on it, and uh, then I afterwards I got a, a, a job after my PhD. I've got a proposal to work on on Java. I work for, for and I said why not this new language? I want to. I'm curious, and I want to look what's going on with uh, with it. How what can we do with it? And uh, quickly, I found out it is too restrictive. I can't do much with it. And uh, once I moved to my uh, current position in the way in 2001, uh, I had uh, I had to make decision what what to use, what which tool to use for for my research. And uh, I studied the state uh, the, 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 the 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 state of the art and. Really, there were no comparable language to small talk, and this is still the case. You have multiple concepts, like uh, I mean, uh, you have some some concepts that are straightforward for our for for small talkers. Uh, the concept of image, and uh, the other language never uh, in they're slowly discovering part of it in some research lab and. We are using it in small talk since uh, since the 80s at the industrial level, and uh, you have if you look at reflection, which is which was what my my first uh, research topic in, in PhD. Uh, I mean, you, you can extend the language very easily. You have all these powerful features, and you you still don't have equivalent in other mainstream languages. And uh, currently, I'm working on distributed system, embedded systems, uh, like uh, systems that, uh, that are, uh, that s I mean, software systems that are embedded in hand handheld devices and in uh, robots. And working also with the with the multiple uh, with multi robot systems that are systems that uh, that are involve multiple robots in order. To perform some complex action where robots need to n learn about each other, to discover each other, and to collaborate in order to perform so some mission. And uh, at this level, I mean, we have small talk is is uh, a perfect tool. We we speaking about embedded systems, uh, something frequent in in this uh, system that you have something in the, the the raw memory and you want to load it to uh, to to ram on a, on on a runtime if you take other languages open they go when you start up you launch the program you they go on from some initiation 
uh, set, uh, staff and too slow. You are in an embedded system. You need to quickly load and the image is exactly uh, useful for, for that. There are other other features, but I don't want to, to, to go deeper in, in detail. Another point, another aspect of uh, user small talk in academia is education, which is which is important. And uh, I uh, I'm currently giving uh, uh, OO courses. I mean, I'm giving OO courses since 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 uh, nine years in my current position, and uh, I quickly found that. Students are uh, doing better in in small talk than in other languages. So I organize my courses and uh, I start with with the with small talk course. And uh, uh, the, the, the 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 main reason of that is that the language is so pure. So you immediately go to the concept. You immediately go to the point. You don't have all this syntactic sugar, all this noise around that uh, make, I mean, blurs the, the, the picture. So students really uh, can go directly to, to the concept and un understand the concept. And something funny, even though they I give them the small talk course first, with other language, they are still doing uh, I mean, it's not as good as doing in in uh, in, in small talk because if you take the they, they have the the, the same uh, time frame for both courses and but for doing the same we're getting the same results with uh, other languages they need longer time frame and this is uh, for me it it means something it means that small talk is re really valuable. Okay, Nuri. Um. Yeah, thanks for introducing this uh, this uh, teaching aspect of small talk. That was something I forgot to ask in my question, but uh, it should be said. Um, okay, um, thanks for being on front of camera. It's not easy, I know. <laughs> and thanks for being here. Thank you, Jordi. Thank you, the City Lab and the 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 the. the, the the City Lab members for uh, inviting me and for organizing uh, this uh, conference. It was great to be here in Barcelona. <laughs>